The buyer of a rare Albert M. at Gyro painting that was being sold to raise money for kidney dialysis has paid above the asking price and donated the artwork back to the art center where it originally came from. The Garachita slash Pimaraj Jara Aboriginal Corporation purchased Albert M. at Jara's Mount Hermas Big in 1989, before loaning it to the Aralu Arts Centre in Alice Springs. But last month the corporation donated the work to the Purple House, to help raise money for life-saving dialysis treatment for Aboriginal people living in remote desert communities. It's an absolutely fabulous outcome because it means we Eve got the money that we need to open services and people in Alice Springs still get to enjoy this rare work by Albert Amat Jira, Sarah Brown, the chief executive officer of the Purple House, said. The artwork almost left Alice Springs, to be sold to the Queensland Art Gallery and Gallery of Modern Art. Our understanding is it would probably go to Queensland because we knew the Queensland Art Gallery. Gallery of Modern Art is interested in growing their Albert Amat Jira collection, Dr. Mark Rees, director of the Aralil Cultural Precinct in Alice Springs, said. The painting will join almost 50 other works held by the Aralil Cultural Precinct, making it the second largest public collection of Albert Amat Jira works in Australia. Dr. Kreese said the work is one of the most significant because of its portrayal of Mount Hermas Big. This work is like a counterpoint to another work that we have by Albert Amat Jira of the Hermas Big Mission, he said. In one painting you see the mission and the houses and in the other you just see Mount Hermas Big, having them both together is quite delightful, Dr. Kreese said. Dr. Kreese said the stories around art help people to understand their value. For example the Mona Lisa was not the most famous painting that da Vinci had painted, and was not even the most famous painting in the Louvre but then it was stolen, he said. After a low-key handing back ceremony, Mount Hermas Big has now been returned to Aralu Arts Centre where it will be kept in collection on a long-term loan. The work is expected to be back on the walls of the Aralu Cultural Precinct in January.